This is uh, Andy Sternberg with LA. I'm here with Cole Sternberg at Normandy Keith's house, his new installation. Uh, so Cole, can you tell me a little bit about the installation? Sure, I'll try to walk you through it. So this is called The Content is Bleeding Through, and it's sort of my vision of this pop apocalyptic moment um, when the media and technology have pushed us so far that all the content just blurs together. Mm -hmm. And the first layer is about 120,000 words of text um, from media sources like PerezHilton.com and People and all the celebrity driven press. Um, the first layer on the ceiling is a list of the 842 Nobel Prize winners. So it's meant to demonstrate sort of this virus cloud coming over everything. So the Nobel Prize winners are already covered and now it's just everything else is sort of blurring together. Um, it's also referencing religion as sort of the media is a new religion and this is you know an altar like supporting that idea. It says I only marked the hours that shine because that was Edith Beale's uh, diary name in 1929 when she was 11 and I just thought wow that really shows where it kids mind frame was at the beginning of modern media when radio was starting to really you know make it throughout society mm -hmm. um, and then to now where it's says stuff like HHDL which is uh, the Dalai Lama's um, nickname on Twitter so he refers to himself as HHDL and I was just like whoa you know that's where we're at where the Dalai Lama even you know really embraces this these kind of quick blips of information yeah so that's what it's about. It took about seven seven months to do, and now it's permanently here at Normandy's house. Wow! And uh, so, the sources for this material are the sources are well. Here is PerezHilton.com representing the internet. Uh, here is People Magazine, Us Weekly, Life and Style represent print. Uh, this wall is CNN, Showbiz Tonight, and E-Transcripts. And then the final wall, I took six the six most mentioned people in here, uh, minus Mel Gibson, because he doesn't have a Twitter, but, um, and I gave them their voices back a little bit, and that's, so that wall and the last layer of the floor is all the Twitter comments. And how do these celebrities, are these celebrities aware that they're part of this project, uh, or? I don't know. Well, I know Lindsay Lohan's aware of it, because she, uh, she came over and did a little photo shoot for fun here, but I don't know, other than her, I don't know who else is. So you haven't that. heard any feedback, good or bad? No. And it's not really critical of them. It's more critical of just like how we progressed as a you know, planet or society. Um, you know, they're the ones that actually are pretty smart about embracing the technology to their own benefit. So, so what do you see as maybe being the next kind of medium? Uh, you know, we've had, we have Twitter, Facebook, and all these different kinds of storytelling now. And I don't know, probably just pictures, just straight you know, visuals with no no yeah. actual content, I guess would be the next thing. So we'll be wearing goggles and... Uh, yeah, you just like one 3D now, right? image is your statement or whatever. I don't know, I mean, you can't condense it too much more than Twitter, right? So, Very true. we'll see. <laughs> All right, great, well, thanks a lot. No worries, anytime.